Hi, and welcome back. In this tutorial, we're going to be making AI respawn. Now, I want to thank Weaver900 for helping me figure this out. Before I begin, I also want to mention that I created a Patreon for those who are asking. You can find the link in the description. Any support is greatly appreciated. Thank you. Now, on with the tutorial. So here we are in Sapien, in our map that we've been working on. Now, the first thing we want to do here in Sapien is to just open up our scenario and open up the AI and squats. Now, let's actually go to the folder in which our Halo 3 mod tools are located. Now, in this folder, you want to go into Data, Levels, Multi, Zanzibar, and in this folder, you might see a folder that says Scripts. If you don't have one, just create a new folder and call it scripts. Now go into that folder and create a new text document. This is going to be the name of our script. So let's just call it respawn AI. Now this is extremely important. You want to change it from a .txt to a .hsc and click OK. It says here, if you change a file name extension, the file might become unusable. Are you sure you want to change it? Just select yes. Now, let's right click this and let's edit with Notepad++. With Notepad++ open, the first thing we want to do is actually move it over to the right here and let's create Sapien on the left. Cool. So now, under our respawn AI script, we want to start off by creating an open bracket and typing script, continuous, space, and now we need to give the script a name. So I'm just going to call it respawn AI zero. So once you have that, you want to hit enter and type in open bracket sleep underscore until space open bracket less than enter open bracket ai underscore living underscore count space quote and now here we want to put the name of the squad that we want to respawn so for this one we're going to do squad zero which is these six grunts back here so i'm going to write squads underscore zero end quote. Now you want to do a closing bracket, one closing bracket, closing bracket. Now just to explain what's going on a bit, we've created a script here that's continuously going to be running throughout the entire time we're in game. And that script is named respawn AI zero. Now we've written sleep until and then we have less than, meaning this basic sleep until basically means don't do anything until the AI living count, which means the number of AI alive within squad zero is less than one. So now let's continue with the rest of the script. Let's hit enter, open bracket, sleep, space, 100, close bracket, enter, open bracket, AI underscore place, space, quote, squads underscore zero, end quote, and then an end bracket. Now you want to hit enter one more time and do another closing bracket. So this next part here pretty much activates when the AI living count of squad zero, so the number of AI alive in squad zero is less than one, sleep for 100 ticks in game, and then place squad zero again. So let's hit control S to save this script, and let's go back into Sapien, and go to scenarios, and hit run game scripts. Now at the bottom left, it might say game scripts disabled. If it says that, just hit it again until it says enabled. Cool. Now the next thing you want to do is go File, Compile Scripts, 
and you'll see here it actually says I have an error. And that's because we can see I wrote continuous wrong. So it's important to make sure all your spelling is correct or else it'll say an error. It'll mention the line the error is on and sometimes give a little bit of a description of what the error actually is. So let's just go ahead here and add the U that's been missing. And now we'll save that, go file, file scripts, and you could see that worked. Now let's go scenario map reset. Now let's just kill that group and see if they respawn. So you'll see here, we're going to kill this last grunt. And now the group has been eliminated. And if we wait a few seconds, there they go, they're respawning. So I can kill them again now. And you'll see they'll respawn again. And they'll be responding indefinitely. Now, let's say we wanted to make another group respawn, like our first group that was up ahead here. Let's go here and select squad one. And that's the group up front here. So to make things simple, let's just select our whole script, copy it, press enter a few times until we have a gap in the middle and paste it. Now you wanna make sure to rename the script. So script continuous, and then this has to be a unique name or else it won't work. So let's recall it respawn AI one. Now, the only other thing we need to do is change the AI living count squad to one and the AI play squad to one. Again, this is just corresponding with the names you have in Sapien. So whatever you name these are what the names you're gonna to wanna to put in your script. So let's save it here using control S and now go to file, compile scripts. Now you just saw there that the group actually respawned because we just compiled the scripts. And now let's just double check again by going over here and killing them. So you can see here, they just respond again and we can kill them again. They'll respawn again and cool. So that's how you make respawning AI and we'll be covering some more scripting tutorials in the future. Thanks for watching and I just wanna thank you guys one more time for all the support that you've been giving me. I really do appreciate it. Until next time.